episode 92, four topics for this week's big news in sneakers. And remember, every time I'm doing this, I'm basically giving you guys a blueprint for how you can be engaged in the sneaker community uh, beyond just buying shoes and things like that. Now, I got a lot of new features on the website, and I want to make sure you guys know the websites that are in the network. So, sneakertheater.com, 901prepscoop.com, arch-usa.com, houseofkicks.com. Four websites in the network, AHN. Make sure you guys check out all of the websites. So, the big stories from Arch this week. Hover has finally been introduced. What is Hover? Hover is the cushioning technology for Under Armour's new running shoes. Now, I'm sure it's going to make its way into Curry and into the basketball line soon, but they've launched with the Phantom and with Sonic, and they dropped a video for it, and I was like going to be really excited. And I think I am still excited, but I need to go and get my hands on these shoes physically. You can read the story on the website. You can click the link down here, and I'm going to put it right there. should just pop up. Bam. So go and check out the story on Under Armour and Hover, their new cushioning system. Next story, and this one is going to be real quick because it's for you guys who are design geeks. If you're a designer and you're looking at creating or uh, creating a company that's going to be bought or invested into by one of the sneaker brands, you need to do something like this. ASICS has a venture capital fund for performance companies. So if you're a startup and you're looking for funding, if you build something that's for the athlete, you might be able to pitch to ASICS Venture. Remember I said that, okay? They invested in a company called AI Silk. Now, the silk that they've created is really amazing. They've woven it into fabric that's basically able to read and censor. It's basically an electron. So you hear the really loud music, but you can go to the site. You can click here. And go to the site and read that um, article because it's a really cool kind of thing to check out. The fabric moves with you and can be read using your phone. Crazy, right? All right, last two things are going to be Nike-based. The LeBron Watch program. Now, Nike has a program that they're calling Basketball Obsessed. The LeBron Watch program is a part of that. And basically, it's a setup for you to interact with the, with the uh, Nike platform. So the customer experience is that if you're signed up for Nike Plus and you are paying attention to what shoes LeBron's wearing during the game, you get a chance to buy the shoes that are on his feet that night. You talk about interactive. You guys need to go and read the article right here so you can learn a lot more about that. Now, the last story we have, and that's going to be a really quick one. If you didn't know that Russell Westbrook has his own fashion line. Now, remember... He was doing the line with, um, what's the jeans company? True Religion. Jordan Brand took that back, pulled it back. I haven't seen Russell Westbrook featured in the True Religion, but he does have his own line with a lookbook with Jordan Brand. And, you know, it doesn't look bad. I, you know, I wouldn't wear it probably because it's going to be way too tight for the kid. That's it. See you guys next week. Make sure you go to the article. It's right there and read that but we appreciate you guys this website's growing everything is happening and it's because of you guys who are tuning in I know I don't have a lot of followers but I value you and I appreciate you and because you like this website I added this donate button and you can go over there and if you want to buy me a donut you can click the donate and donate a dollar keep the website running we run this man and it's expensive but we do it because we love the culture and we want everybody to have something and hopefully people grow beyond what we're doing and do something on their own. That's it. Episode 92. See you guys next week. Peace.